Hey, buddy. <laughs> Wanna say hi to our guest? <laughs> Are you sure you got everything you need for the night? Okay, but if there's anything you're missing, we can just go to the store down the street. They're still open. Yeah, okay. Here, let me get that for you. Ugh, come on now. It's no trouble at all. I mean, how long have we known each other now? Friends help each other out, and I know if I were in a similar position, you drop everything to come and help me out. Yeah, don't worry about it. I promise it's fine. In fact, I insist on you staying for as long as you need. <laughs> Let me go set up the futon. Uh, hold on. Wait. What? Ugh, why is it that everyone needs me tonight? <sighs> Sorry, dude, but I gotta head out for a few minutes. My mom needs me to drop her off at the airport. <laughs> yeah, I'm just a glorified cab driver tonight. I'll be back in, like, 40 minutes or so. I mean... You've been here enough times to know where everything is, so if you want to get some shut-eye soon, you can go ahead and set up without me. <laughs> yes, of course. I'll be back. I think my pajamas are on the couch, so if you're in your room, don't come out. What the hell? What in the world are you doing here? What? Oh, wait. You're Beth's friend, right? I've seen you around here once or twice. Uh, yeah, that's me. Hello. Uh, yeah. This whole roommate thing is a fairly new arrangement. I mean, Beth and I have been friends for eons, so it only makes sense for the two of us to move in together. Mm-hmm. Uh, so... I don't mean to be rude or anything, but... What exactly are you doing here? You're staying the night? Oh. Uh, no, 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 no. There's absolutely nothing wrong with that. We're happy to have you. But I just, um... Well, honestly, I would have appreciated a heads up from her. That's all. Was a spur of the moment type thing. Did something happen? Oh. Oh, I see. Oh, no. And Beth insisted that you stay with us. Well, I mean, <laughs> I'm not surprised that she did. I would, too. Mm-hmm. Yeah, of course. And thank you for sharing. That sounds really rough. I mean, I can relate, though. <laughs> yeah, I mean, the whole reason why Beth and I decided to live together was because I found out that my ex was cheating on me. Yep, and even though the lease wasn't up yet... I couldn't stand being in the same room as him, so I decided to just up and move out. <laughs> no, he was furious. He thought that I didn't have anywhere else to go, since at the time, I didn't have a job and was digging into my savings to get by. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I'm a huge believer of the whole when one door closes, another one opens philosophy, because the second I left him, my life got so much better. I found a nice job, I get to live with my best friend, and I have a cute dog to play with, so what more can I ask for? <laughs> yeah. Well, uh, what about you? Well, other than licking your wounds, what are you gonna do now? Oh, yeah, I get that, but that's okay, too. <laughs> of course. Yeah, of course it's alright to just take your time when it comes to dealing with these things, and especially healing. No, they'll do otherwise. Oh, sweetheart. 
I'm so sorry that you had to deal with that all this time. You don't deserve that. No. No, you don't. Well, I don't know if I can be considered a good judge of character, considering I was just talking about a cheating ex, but I know for a fact that Beth is, and if she thinks you're good, then you're good. <laughs> well, I'm glad we can agree on that front. <laughs> hey, bud. Have you said hi yet? Yeah, you can pick him up. He loves being held. <laughs> You've made a new friend, haven't you? <laughs> so cute. I was talking to the dog, but I think you're pretty cute, too. <laughs> I know you were teasing, but the one thing you should know about me is that I never back down when someone decides to tease me. Nope. It's a lot more fun this way. Usually people who tease never expect you to tease them back. <clears throat> well, I definitely wasn't joking about that. I really do think you're cute. Hmm. <laughs> 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 oh, right. I forgot. Sorry, I just got so lost in our conversation that I haven't gotten dressed yet. <sighs> oh, hush it, you spoiled little baby. I'll give you more cuddles after. <laughs> and yes, you can have some of this too. I just have to find my pajamas. Hmm? Well, I was in a rush this morning, so I was kind of everywhere. Yeah, I think... I think I was brushing my teeth whilst making a smoothie and putting on my clothes whilst packing my lunch. <laughs> yeah, I, I promise I'm not usually a mess, but during that whole process, I ended up throwing my pajamas somewhere. Mm -hmm. Mind helping me look for them? <laughs> Thanks. Ugh, where are they? I swear if Beth put them in the wash... And they're in the dryer. Well, I guess I'll just have to find a shirt or something. <laughs> no, it's fine. It's my fault for leaving my clothes lying around. I swear, I, I usually am pretty organized, but this morning was just terrible. <laughs> yeah. Um, have you ever had one of those days where the second you wake up, you just know that everything is going to go wrong? Yeah, so I shot awake, got that feeling of dread, checked my phone, and realized that my alarm didn't go off, and I had 10 minutes to drive down to the train station, so I got up, ran to the bathroom, brushed my teeth, made a breakfast smoothie, put on the first pieces of clean clothing I could find whilst trying to drink said smoothie, because if I didn't, I wouldn't have been able to eat until 2 or 3 in the afternoon, since I had meetings all day today, packed my bags, ran out the door, Got to the station, got to work right as the first meeting started, got into an argument with my client, then got grilled by my boss for getting into an argument with said client, even though my boss agreed with my points. Spent the rest of the day catching up because half my team was sick, got back, took a shower, and met you. Whilst having nothing but a towel on. Yeah. <laughs> Hectic day, but nothing compared to what you're going through right now, so... Don't worry about it. <laughs> it was just one of those days, you know? <laughs> well, if you really wanted to make me feel better, how about letting me borrow your shirt whilst I wait for my clothes to finish up? <laughs> uh -huh. You're far too easy to tease. I'm just kidding. Well, looks like the dryer's almost done, so I suppose I can wait. Yes, while still wearing a towel. Why? Am I making you uncomfortable? <laughs> really? You find it difficult to look at me? No, oh, please. I'm sure you know exactly where to look. <laughs> I'm kidding. Uh, I seriously need to go find something to wear, so I'll be right back. <laughs> 